So the law is plainly failing rape victims. That must be obvious to you. It is, but in fairness, the law wasn't built to serve victims. In fairness? I know. They're seeing the Backstreet Boys now? Do you believe me? Do I believe you? Of course I do. Seriously? I'm not here on a fact-finding mission. I'm just curious. Be really honest. Okay, I've heard two competing stories. One from a very credible woman who, as far as I can see, has no reason to lie. The other from a guy I judge to be a little sketchy who has every reason to lie. And I'm obligated to believe the sketchy guy. Well, we're not in a courtroom. You're not legally obligated to presume innocence. I believe I'm morally obligated. You're a good guy, but do people tell you a lot your head's up your ass? They do. And I absolutely allow for that possibility. I'm the guy who goes around saying OJ's not guilty because a jury said so. Right, but I'm not gonna get a jury. I know, and I can imagine how frustrating no. that must... No. You can't imagine. I can't. But it's a huge, dangerous, ominous, scary as shit mistake to convene your own trial in front of a television audience where there's no due process, no lawyers, no discovery, no rules of procedure, decisions on admissible evidence, threat of perjury, confrontation of witnesses, or any of the things we do to ensure that rapists go to Stanford Medical School. To ensure that an innocent person isn't destroyed. The law will acquit him, but the internet never will. The internet gets used for vigilantism every day, but this is a whole new level, and if we go there, we're truly fucked. I'm not a vigilante. Do you want to live in a world where... Okay, do you want to get some real advice? This is the advice that I get in pamphlets. Say you have a boyfriend, wear a wedding ring. I am supposed to protect myself from a man by pretending I'm the property of another man. Not to mention the endless supply of fashion advice. Mary. You wanted to meet in a public place because you were scared that I was going to cry rape. I'm scared of getting raped. I'm scared all the time. All the time. So do you want to know what my site does? It scares you. It scares the shit out of any guy who even thinks about laying a hand on someone who didn't give them an invitation. You're right to name your attacker. You may even be obligated to. But the site's going to clobber an innocent person. There's no chance it won't. And if you face off with the guy you've accused on TV, it's going to be a lawless food fight with irreversible, irretrievable consequences. Teams will be formed, you will be slut-shamed, and you won't get the justice you're looking for. That's why I'm asking you to refuse. Why do you need me to refuse? It's your show. Why can't you just do it? I've been overruled. It's a promotable story they'll bring in a younger audience. I'm fine with that. It's sports, Mary. It's going to be covered like sports. Yeah. And this time I'm going to win. All right. Thanks for hearing me out. We'll be in touch with you.